Welcome back to the COVID-19 Surveillance Dashboard. As we promised you in the last video, we've updated several aspects of the dashboard and we'd like to make sure you're taking full advantage of these robust features. We've decided that in order to provide the most accurate representation of the pandemic, it is best to track the number of active cases. Active equals the number of confirmed, minus deaths, minus recovered. By playing the new time slider feature, you can see how the pandemic has progressed across the globe. Note the dynamic chart on the left side is updating as the slider moves through time. You can change the chart contents by selecting the categories you'd like to include. At the bottom of the map, you can see the cumulative number of countries and territories that have reported confirmed cases of the virus. If you pause the time slider, you can see the numbers above the chart reflect what happened on that particular date. You can choose if you'd like to view cumulative or daily data in the chart. Clicking the reset button on the map brings you back to the most current information. Right now, you can see the data for all regions of the world. If you'd like to focus on your specific country, Simply choose it from the drop-down menu or begin typing the name. Hovering over a particular bar in the chart will provide either cumulative or daily data for that date and can include the categories you'd like to see. To learn more about the features of our dashboard, including what has changed with each update, make sure you click on that FAQ button. The Biocomplexity Institute wants researchers around the world to focus on pandemic response efforts and not spend precious time curating data. To this end, we're happy to make our data available to you by clicking the Download All button. You will then have access to country and state level data in CSV format. To learn more about our work on the COVID-19 pandemic or our research in general, click the More Options button in the right corner.